happy holiday, happy Labor Day to all of the SMF Street traders and international people around the world. And once again, international people, meaning that if you don't have a U.S. citizenship in the U.S., that doesn't matter. You qualify to be on SMF Street. Your next step would simply sign up. All right, we're going to be talking about with our MMTs is that we're looking at a Netflix 140 put on a 60 minute chart and as they're being trained correctly they're going from a complete retail value to an SMF market maker wholesale value and when we get the value of this particular option that we're looking at which just happens to be the Netflix 918 140 put they've already been given a trade management so I'm putting the video together for you now you already have your pricing structures and your pricing controls okay so this is a video that goes along with those numbers that you have written down on your pad and those belong to you because you're an MMT the people that may be visiting the video of Innocence, uh, welcome to SMF Street. You too also have a chance to get on board. And you can do that by witnessing a free five day trial. That's all you have to do is come and witness what we do. Uh, we're not here to sell you anything. We're not here to convince you of anything. However, SMF Street has opened its doors to uh, Main Street. So, MMTs, here we are. As we're dealing with this, we have the price action. What I'm going to show you here on the 60-minute chart is, is that way back over here, we had these contracts were opening up then on 630. These things were up, up here at the high of 32.85. That was then. Some of the more recent highs were just right over here on 830. 8.30 is not that far ago. And the high, 18.15. And the low was 17.75 then. And because of our discipline and understanding the other side of the market has allowed us the capital risk privilege to engage in a transaction by looking at both the call and the put side. The equity side we will do here on this daily chart. The equity is as follows as we're talking about is we made the highs in the equity which that interday high was 142 and a half now and the low was 138.05. What a nice move in those directional movements and basically what I want to talk about is this daily chart and I'm just showing you a daily chart I'm gonna pull this up a little bit and I'm gonna hit this right here so basically on a daily chart we had a gap me gap me and gap me and what does that mean for the people that might not understand outside of the MMT does what it means is an artificial price gap and then they opened it and then they ran the stock it wasn't as if you were buying through the stock like here you buy through and you kind of pull back a little bit you come up and you kind of come down that's a buy through over here something like that up toward that top then that top failed and we had a key area that was very very important and once it broke those tops it came up and it challenged that and made a 52 week high right well a 52 week high as far as these four days so let's keep that straight the highs are right up here because here's the full trend of 010 which has been a very nice solid trend what I am going to do is tell you that if we fail here as you know if we fail here and we cannot close above that line then that means that this put option down here has got price control for you and you already have the numbers and the figures so MMTs, I, SMF MMTs that is, I want you to understand where the pricing controls will be in your SMF MMT 
trading platform because this is just a chart but your MMT platform has already plotted all of this out automatically for you so we are wholesale here we are wholesale here and you can take a look that even over here that this high right there was 705 so you get the right wholesale entries that's you get the right wholesale entries below the market you got a nice spread and we'll use the intraday MMT platform to establish how to get this entry so you'll be using the SMFT platform that's the chart here's the thing that we're going to be focusing on once again for you if I can't close above it guess what I'm going to come down. Now, if that comes down, MMTs, this goes up. Here's something to be uh, happy. This is 960 on the high right there on 92. Okay, Tuesday is going to be what? Today is 95, uh, 2010, and the time is 8:22 a.m. So tomorrow's a holiday, which is going to put it 96. So we're going to open up on Tuesday. And we're going to see how the gap sequence on the equity plays out. Here is a monthly move of that contract. And down here, you can see on 6-1, like I said, the high was 33.40. The next month, right here, they came down. And now we're down here at 590. That's the monthly view, SMF, MMTs. MMTs here is the 140 call and once again that's your so we're gonna get top ended up here they could still got room to go this one's already down here as we've talked about but let's take a look at where that low was the low was 89 pennies the current high was 660 what a nice trade four days up how nice to get some money out of the call side of the market remember we're going into a September kickoff everyone's coming back from vacation and also remember the options expiration and the imbalance between calls and puts and the mathematical system that SMF allows you to use to make money 135 put SMF MMTs you can take a look at the $15 where they were the date it's right there 14.75 then they fell down we'll just do the lows but we'll do the highs first 1475 this high 890 this high MMT 651 and MMT's this high is 390 so we're getting down into that very deflated range the 130 put just so people know as well because you want to see that side of the market this is where it was ten dollars and we're getting down very wholesale here on the 130 put SMF MMTs once again I'm going to show the 130 call in the money which also happens to be right there now it's totally inflated so that means that this trade down here that's inflated price this is deflated price there's going to be your SMF MMT mathematical equations will equate this for you and you will take your entries accordingly to the imbalance ratio MMTs what you would look for is the value the value to start losing just as these gap down values happen four days in a row here what you would be looking for on the daily stock chart dot com daily stock charts daily stock charts dot com so basically what you want to know is that if I'm going down here then I have to go up there you've been given a gift 